FTV Julian, um, he was so negative there, wasn't he? Yard man, to, to me, um, the team's playing well. The team's playing excellently, but it's not just about how well they're playing tactically. It's that enthusiasm, which again, I don't think could be coached, but what Arteta did from very early on is he looked at the team, he looked at the squad, and he took out the players that didn't fit. It might have not been straight away, but the first thing he did, he got rid of Ozil. Um, mm. You know, he mm. didn't have the work rate. He was lazy, which was infectious throughout the team. He got rid of Genduzi, who I personally liked, but obviously had an attitude, didn't quite fit. Mm. Then he's got rid of a, a Bamiang for disciplinary reasons. So what he's got is a squad and a team that pulls together. And it's not about individual players. Mm. It's about this team mentality and this we're not going to get beaten. And what you saw today, I thought in the first half, tactically was a good performance. They looked at the way Villa set up and it was very narrow and they exploited the wings really well. The finishing, not great. I mean, we, we had a look at the uh, the Saka um, replayed. It was... It, 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 look, it wasn't quite Ronnie Rosenthal, mm. but it was pretty <laughs> close. Um, he should have scored. He really should have scored. We should have been out of sight, but we weren't. And then what happens in the second half? Villa are only going to get better because they couldn't really get any worse. Mm. And we struggled. And the last 10, 20 minutes was nervy. Mm. And it was nervy, but listen, we got the job done. They scored... Martinelli again. This kid is, is some player we got here, isn't it? Yeah. And how old is he now? 21? Yeah. 21. He is getting better. But again, he's got the skill, but he's got tenacity. One thing I noticed, I think you did as, as well in the first half, mm. he lost it. And what did he do? He worked. He worked. And that was nothing about skill. That was sheer desire. And again, I'll come back to Arteta putting players on the pitch, putting players in our squad that have that desire. We would not be beaten. We went out there to win. So when so when they got their goal, what did we do? Straight on them. The crowd. We, we infect the players with positivity. We're telling the players through our enthusiasm that you're going to go on and you're going to score. Mm. So the, the difference today to how I look back at the last few years was when we went 1-0 one, one down or the team equalised, the crowd were down. What happened? We got infused that we knew what was coming. We knew mm. there was going to be an Arsenal winner. Although we celebrated and it was, a, it was great for us, it actually wasn't a surprise. Yep. And uh, listen, Old Trafford weekend, you've been there many a year. I've been there many a year. Apart from that time we went up there, Danny Welbeck, oh, FA Cup. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, that was beautiful. But in the league, I was so disappointed last year, I remember. I've been there when they've been horrible, when they've been off form. I remember that year we went there when Rashford scored, when he just emerged on the scene. No one even knew who he was, and they still beat us. We've got to try and do something up there, haven't we? We're gonna yeah. Sunday, mate, we're, we are going to smash them. I wouldn't say 3 0, yeah, but I, I really believe this time we are going to go up there and we're going to beat them. But everyone seems to think, and, and we keep hearing this, that we haven't won up there in the Premier League since you were saying 2004, 2005. I, no, that, no lady, that lady said Correct. that. I never said that. Correct. No, I've only won there. With, yeah, we, we won there. We won there. She, no, what she said is we haven't won there with a, with a crowd. Because oh, remember. Well, it depends we what won your there. definition of a crowd. We have won there in a couple of seasons ago. We had El Nenny in midfield. Yep. We had yep. Party played one of the best games he's played. Yep. And Lukonga can fill that gap. I mean, one thing today, uh, one of the many positives was Lukonga's performance. Yeah. He, he was really classy. He's still a young boy. He, when you think back at his performances at the beginning of last season, he was terrific. Throughout the season, something went a little bit wrong. Maybe he didn't get enough games. The confidence was down. He's come in today. I thought he was one of the best players. Mm. He, he was, he, yeah, he did so miss. Confident we can get a win at Old Trafford. I'm always confident, so I'm probably the wrong yeah, person to yeah, ask. Yeah, yeah. Shouldn't have bothered. <laughs> Shop for AFTV merch at shop.aftv.co.uk. Subscribe to us on YouTube. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat, and Twitch. We've got content for every platform, so check it out.